Let a king be lifted up. Let a king be lifted up. Let a king be lifted up. Oh, Let our King be lifted up. Let our King be lifted up. Hosanna in the highest. Let a king be lifted up. Hosanna. Hosanna in the highest. Let a king be lifted up. Let a king be lifted up. Hold the ribbon, let a king be lifted up. Hosanna. My bad, my bad. <laughs> Hello, welcome, good morning, Lulu Bell, Enenea, uh, Superfood Parents. I love to laugh is what I was saying when I realized that there was no sound. And I said, everybody's going through something, and I believe... One of the things that we have to help us. No, I wasn't singing. I wasn't singing. I wasn't singing. I believe I was. I paused it to cough. I'm still a little bit under the weather. It's not as bad as I was on Friday, but there was a lot of vocal activity happening over the weekend 
And uh, I thank God that I made it through. Thank God that I made it through. Um, you know, sometimes it's it's hard to, it's like, how do I talk about this? <laughs> how do I even bring it up? She yeah, but sure, sure. <laughs> mm-hmm. So two things. One, um, I was supposed to go to a apple cider pressing. Huh. Apple cider pressing. And when I got there, there was nobody there. The reason for that was one of the co-workers of the people who were pressing passed away a tragic car accident on Saturday. So this was Sunday. I went and I found out that the apple cider pressing was was canceled. <clears throat> so for those of you who don't know what apple, apple cider pressing is, basically all it is, you take the apples, you wash them, you, you know, wash them in, uh, uh, you know, soap and water, get all the, the dirt and the mud and all that stuff off. You rinse them twice, three times. So you wash, there's a wash station, there's a rinse station, there's another rinse station. And then uh, the the person who does the pressing has these presses, you know, you, you take the apples, you put them in, and you just, like, compress the apples and it squeezes out all of the juice and you're left with the pulp of the apple um, with the skin and everything on there, right? <clears throat> and you really crank that crank all the way until you can't get any more juice out of it. And then, you know, the juice goes into a bucket when that's full you pour it into a filtration. They have a filtration. They built this filtration system to gather all this. Like so many cores of apple is like a ridiculous amount. You know, you have the truck, like a pickup truck with the sides raised. And, you know, it's just packed, filled with apples. You know, you go to the, there was one farm that they had, got together with and uh, thank you Tamaris and one of the things that really you know it's an, an I really like that process and you get f- unfiltered raw apple cider like the juice from the app. When they say no added preservatives, it is that. You take it, you put it in the freezer, and you're good when you want some real apple juice. They say it's cider, but I mean, I guess, yeah, it's real apple juice. No, nothing added to it. It's just apple. And you know it's just apple. So I was looking forward to that, and so I was... I was really, you know, taken aback, but then I thought, you know, yes, selfish me wanted the apple cider because I love apple cider. But, you know, I prayed for the family because they were hurting. It was just like in shock, in complete disbelief. This person, you would never expect them to be gone, and then they're gone. <clears throat> so that's the one. So we're playing for the Mott family. And 
on Saturday as well, there was the celebration of life for one of our deacons at the church. And this was for a community church that I partner with. I do music and we minister together, um, Deacon Talbert. So it was his homegoing celebration. <clears throat> so praying for the Talbert family, praying for the Mott family. We have been praying for baby Adira and... Um, it is it's so great now to know that hi Lee welcome welcome baby Adira is home with grandma and that is something to celebrate so I'm just gonna do this I'm gonna go I'm gonna I, I, I gotta show you this this is well I don't know if it's okay is it okay to show <laughs> is it okay to show I don't know if Christine's still here Christine are you still here thank you Lee appreciate that um, oh did not mean to put that on the stream let's take that off All right, um, somebody type something. <laughs> Say, it is get some engagement. Yeah, so. Actually, no, she did say to show it to all those who have been praying. And so I wanted to share this with you guys. Thank you guys for praying for baby Adira. It's, y'all are going to be just thrilled to see this. I'm going to get a new blank scene. And I'm just going to pull this in. How about that? Except... I wasn't able to pull it in. There it is. Okay. Y'all are not going to be ready for this. Ain't that precious? Precious. We'll get it in the middle. Absolutely precious baby Adira in the flesh. She's home, happy and smiling. Maybe right now. This this is not a picture from this moment, but I'm gonna I'm gonna put her on my main scene. I'm gonna put her on the main scene. I'm just gonna put put her there. So, keep praying for Adrian Nash. Thank you for sharing that today. I wanted to. I wanted to share that picture because it blessed me when I saw it. And so Christine said, "And let me." 
say exactly what she said so I don't misconstrue. This is the first day with no medication and getting closer to going home. First day, no medication, no pain medication. Adorable and an answer to prayer. Y'all. So, has had several heart uh, surgeries, or maybe one or two. I forget how many. But, yeah. So, there are, so there are things on my heart this morning I really had to, to play through. And, um, Hosanna. I, I I had to rejoice even with the Mott family and the Talbert family. They were still, once you have breath in your lungs, you have an opportunity to share, right? I just briefly stopped by Lee's live stream on Saturday and was really... Um, was it Saturday or Thursday? No, I think I missed Saturday. I missed you on Saturday. Uh, Thursday, last Thursday. Being able to share in the experience with others. And that's you guys are here sharing in this experience today. And I hope it, this is blessing you. You know, um, Adrian was saying the music was beautiful and soothing. Um. And that's the that's the goal, right? That's the goal to make sure, David. Do you play that kettle drum behind you? <laughs> or is that a picture? That is a steel drum. I'm glad you asked that question. Let's just let's check this out. Steel drum. That's that's a steel drum. Yeah. Yeah, so it's uh, a product from from my home country, Trinidad and Tobago, my country of origin cuz I have made the United States my home. But Trinidad, I guess it's still still home. My my mom, my brothers, cousins, you know, schoolmates, classmates that I grew up with. Of course, there are others who have emigrated to the UK, to Australia, to, you know, to uh, New Zealand, the US, Canada. <clears throat> In fact, there is one of my classmates from high school lives in Worcester, which is like the second largest city in Massachusetts um, behind Boston. You have Boston and then Worcester, right? We say Worcester, spelled Worcester, W-O-R-C-E-S-T-E-R. What? Worcester? No, Worcester. So yeah, no, it's good. So thank you, Rebecca, for asking the question. Um, thank you, Lee. I 
I do what I can. I mean, you've learned to play. Where are these doubles? Where are those doubles? In L.A.? You know, there are doubles in L.A. Um, are you in, I think you're in L.A. That's where I had you placed, Adrian Nash. Nash, let me know if you're in another place. Steel drums have that vibrant frequency that sounds like pure joy. Hey, listen, Lee, you ain't said nothing but a word right there. You haven't said any. That's a good word, basically. I'm saying steel drums have that vibrant frequency. Hey, Ennea, come through. We are glad that you are here. Come through, Ennea. Let's try this again. <laughs> and then there it comes in. <laughs> just, this is so good. It's like we have to clap it up for in there. We haven't seen you all stream. So we're glad for you coming through. Bravo with Sheila. Absolutely glad you're here, Lee. First floor audio. I don't want to do the records like. <laughs> That's the wrong button to press, right? But we're definitely going to clap it up. I have some more I need to upload on, onto my the buttons. All right, so my first page is just. The different things is like wah, 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 wah. that's not what we're doing. Pasadena. Okay, so that's LA, right? LA County. It's basically LA. Okay. Cool. Pasadena. That's an awesome place. I'll be coming to I'll be coming to California sometime next year, I believe. So indeed, we we are grateful for for it, and um, as we look to to the rest of the week, we have the rest of the week coming up. New toy, David, a soundboard, cool and fun. <laughs> no, I've had this. Um, I've had this for a minute, uh, Lee. Um, gives me the opportunity to sound really, really big. Or maybe if I need to speak a little higher, but yes. Oh, wow. Rebecca, that's cool. You were born in the San Bernardino, San Bernardino. My goodness. Yo, I was up uh, last year. This time I was just coming back from California. I had a trip out there for a conference. And um, San Bernardino, oh, man, that's amazing. So... Yeah, so a lot of people in in uh, Loma Linda you community, my aunt lives in Yukaipa. So, you know, we usually stay with her when we go with my aunt and uncle. We stay with them when we go to when we go to California. Fly into Ontario. They tell us, "Don't go to LA." <laughs> Because it's going to take you four hours to go from L.A. International to Yukaipa. Don't do it. Go to Ontario. So we fly into Ontario. Well, that's great, Rebecca. He's like, yes. The touch points even. We meet on the stream, but then we realize you have more in common than, than if you had never cut together. So that's good. So anyway, Lee... This is what you see. This is this is what I'm I'm playing with. 
The pitch goes up. The pitch goes down. And everyone is afraid. Be afraid. Be very afraid. <laughs> oh, that's what that is. So, anyway, this is what I get. The reverb. All right, if you see. This one light up. It's the reverb. It goes light. See, like that. Right? Even... Even Adrian is like, don't, don't go to LAX. Don't do that to yourself. <laughs> uh, I mean, if you have, to, if your business is in LA, then, you know, it would be probably the best one to go to. So, yeah, this is the uh, Roadcaster Pro. Um, <clears throat> Excuse me, Lee. The Roadcaster Pro 2. The Roadcaster Pro 2. And um, an amazing piece of kit. It's, it, it's, um, it's amazing. So a, f a friend of mine, uh, Kirk Nugent, said he, they did a, a, a production where they had, you know, the big box company, one of the major networks here in the U.S. came, and the guy was, one of the, the audio technicians was checking out the Roadcaster Pro. And he was like, man, the amount of stuff this thing could do, it's just amazing. The routing, um... And and when I say the routing, it's 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 so good that you could put a channel or an output and have it be in any you can remove like if you don't want the second headphone to hear what's coming out of the second USB channel, you can cut it out. Or if you don't want it to hear the Bluetooth channel, you can turn that off. So, you know, someone, they don't want to hear themselves, you can turn them off on their channel. It's amazing. It's amazing. Mac, you made it. Thank you so much for coming through. And uh, thanks for asking. It. Whoa, 7-Eleven. Yo, gotta go. <laughs> Have a blessed week. Expecting snow in Maine. Yeah. Then it will be all of a sudden winter in New England. We're expecting some of that snow tomorrow or late tonight into t tomorrow. But it's expected to be no accumulations, right? Little to no accumulation. You'll see the snow. It'll be there. Yay. And then it'll be melted and gone. In Jesus' name. <laughs> I'm not ready for snow. Not yet. What's this tech sorcery you're talking about? <laughs> it's like... Be afraid. Be very afraid. <laughs> oh, that's so good. All right, so you guys have a blessed day. Look for Mac at 3 p.m. Eastern. Oh, wait. Is that still 3 p.m. Eastern? Mac, because I think you're on um, Daylight Savings, or you're off Daylight Savings as of yesterday. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Absolutely. Let me know, Mac, if you guys are off your time or are you still on C 
Central European. Okay, so it is at 4 p.m. All right. Until we switch, we fall back, and then we will go back to three. Got it. Yes. You know what? I really didn't talk about what I was going to talk about today. Your time is now 12. Okay. So we're seven, which means we're we're five hours. Our five hour, our six hours is not lining up till next Sunday when we change. Right. I think this change has been going on for about 15 years, 18 years, 18 years. Because I think it was 2006 is when they made the adjustments here in the U.S. The rest of the world says, nah, we're going to keep what we got. (laughs) It puts us out a week here. A week here in the U.S. in the fall. In the spring, I think it's two weeks where things are like, wait, is it seven or is it six? So anyway, we got that. All right, 11 of you still on the live. So Mac is live at 4 p.m. Eastern. Cool beans. That's good to know. All right, we will see you all on Wednesday we have another program scheduled for you I may have to bring back the live because every time I sit down to try and work on it the song love is the cure I keep wanting more we gotta open the door and don't sleep on the floor So we keep it moving, 7.15, y'all. We have got to get out of here. We'll see you on the next one. Take care, y'all. Ciao. Be good to yourselves. Don't forget to use your hands and your voice and your heart. Powered by love to hit a home run. It's not Major League Baseball, but... We are here to make life better. The MLB crew in full effect. Be the reason someone smiles today. Take care. Ciao. Like C-I-A-O as we say in Italy. Right? Ciao. Take care, guys. Bye. All the best, Lee. All right. Albert, Adrian, N.A., Mac, Superfood Parents, Lulu Bell, Tamaris. I'm going to miss a name. I know Ruby. Um, Have a great day. We'll see you. Take care.